All right, it's time for you guys to get a money lesson compared to the XRP. Because a lot of people are like, well, XRP is not going to be worth this. It's going to be worth that. I'm going to give you. I'm going to give you a lesson. Better remember. Okay, I want you to tell me what you can buy with this. This is a U.S. nickel. Okay, I can't find a penny. I don't even know when was the last time I saw a penny. But just think nickel. You can take a penny if you want. You can take a dime. Now, I'll ask you a question. What can you buy with it? Exactly, nothing. Now, take a $100 bill. What can you buy with this? You'll tell me a lot of things, right? You'll tell me a lot of things. I can buy dinner, groceries, gas. I can do a bunch of things. But let me just make something to you. This is currency. This is still US currency tied to the treasury but it's absolutely worthless. There was a time when this can get you things in America. Now you do this, but this can barely cover the things it used to cover. So what happens is they keep adding more dollars to an existing archaic old US dollar system. You know, they keep printing it. Look at this, what are we like 31 trillion deficit? What I'm trying to explain to you is this is worthless. So they continue printing this. Do you understand? So then you can take a lot of these guys and hopefully you'll get a this. Now you're telling me XRP is not gonna be in high price, but they're attaching gold, minerals, they're attaching like all types of commodities, agriculture, I mean, oil. I mean, just, just place it. They're going to attach all of that. They're not printing money. The only way that system in the BRICS is going to work is they're going to have a gold backed currency that everybody's going to agree upon. And then everybody's going to have to put up their country's assets, um, you know, oil, gold, minerals, whatever, in order to back their currency, in order for, to get the XRP, the value system. Let me explain something to you. This, the game of printing all this, there's nothing behind it. There's nothing behind it. So you're telling me I have to recognize this as a leak. If I go to a bank and steal a bunch of these, I go to prison because they say this is money. But technically speaking, one of these things can't buy anything. This has been a giant Ponzi scheme that people have been killing themselves for for years, but it's not backed by anything. It used to be, it should be again, it will be again. But right now, this is technically worthless. You just take it at face value. Do you understand? I say people that go, I love you, I love you, I love you so much, I love you. Then you go, hmm, how do you love me? Do you care for me? Do you look out for me? Do you teach me? Do you advise me? Do you keep me out of harm's way? Remember, I love you, I love you, I love you. There's nothing behind this. That's the reason why XRP is going to be something incredible because XRP and this are absolutely worthless. But the second you start pegging assets, minerals, and the resources of, 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 of a country, that's the difference. If America did that to this dollar, if we back this in gold and oil, what would this be worth? I will tell you what this would be worth. This would be an entire week's salary for a middle class, a middle class family. But because it isn't, because it isn't backed by anything, is as worthless today as XRP. The only difference is XRP is in the process of being backed by everything. So. I hope that helps. One second, you know how we end this. By the way, my neighbors, I'm gonna have one neighbor on the other side. She's like this like hot chick with this dog that like ate, ate it. Well, technically, that hamster, I had nothing to do with his disappearance. That dog, that dog had issues. But anyway, like he must really love the X-Men movies. <laughs> One second. Oh no, he didn't!
X-Force. Their best part.